All right, onion slip planting time. Here's my onion slips. Didn't turn out as well as I'd hoped, but we're gonna plant what we got and we're gonna see how they go. So when you plant slips, usually they're gonna fall over and they're gonna look really bad for about the first week, but it's just part of it. They're fairly hardy and uh, just excited to get these in the ground. There's about four different varieties here. I made a video when I seeded them. If you wanna go back and find that video, you'll see exactly what varieties they are. I know one of them's Lissa Craig, one of them's Sweet Spanish Onion, and then there was a couple other varieties in there, but I'm gonna go about five inch spacing all the way around on these. I'm gonna get in there and get planting. So onions are really hardy and durable when it comes to pulling them apart. So as you can see in that one cell, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, possibly eight plants in there. You just unravel the roots, try to break as little as possible. And I like to plant them right until the white is no longer exposed. I just push, lay it on the ground like that, and I'll just push right into my finger. And that tends to work out really well for me. The last step is watering them in really good. Like I said, you don't want them to dry out. That'll be the worst thing for your newly planted onion plants. So you want to give them a good drink afterwards. That's all there is to it. They should start taking off in a couple weeks. After about two to three weeks, you start hitting them with the high nitrogen fertilizer. That's the key to big onions. You want to hit them with some high nitrogen until they get to the bulbing phase, which is usually when they get uh, seven to ten leaves and then you want to cut off all fertilization. Have a great day.